Good morning, students. Welcome to Teacher I class. Okay, I hope everyone is doing well today. So before we start the new lesson today, let us have a quick recap of our lesson yesterday. Okay, yesterday we study about the life cycle of a frog. So do you know where, where the new frog come from? Okay. Do you know the how the life of a frog start started? So everybody, let us listen again. Okay, a new frog comes from an egg. Okay, as you can see. Okay, look at the eggs of a frog. It looks like a an eyeball. All right, so again, the eggs hatch in one into three weeks. All right, so this is the first stage of the life cycle of a frog. Okay, from egg, then a tadpole hatches from an egg. So this is the tadpole. Okay, as you can see, a tadpole lives in the water. And what are they used in order to breathe in the water, they use their gills, right? Okay, and look at the tadpole. Tadpole had no legs. That's the second stage of a frog. And then next, a tadpole grow into a froglet. Okay, look at the difference from tadpole to a froglet. A froglet looks like looks more like a frog, right? And as you can see, a froglet has legs now, okay? And has a tail. Look, they use their legs in for hopping and walking. That is the third stage of the life cycle of a frog. And then when a froglet grow, it will turn into an adult, Frog. So look at the difference of from froglet to a to an adult frog. No tail. Very good. So an adult frog doesn't have a tail, and a female frog lays an egg. So that is the life cycle of a frog. So are you ready for our lesson today? If you are ready, let's begin. Our lesson for today is about the parts of a frog. Do you know the different parts of a frog? If you're ready, let's start. Okay, this is how frog look like. As you can see, a frog has different colors. So let's start. Okay. A frog have eyes also. The same with you, my. A frog also have eyes. Okay, let's spell the word I. E Y E. I. Let's proceed to the next part of a frog. Okay, look at the arrow, where the arrow is pointing. So, what do you call this part of a frog? Nostril, yes, nostril, N O S T R I L, nostril. Very good. Next, a frog have mouth. Yes, also have a mouth. M O U, T, H, mouth. And then a frog have an ear. Very good, an ear. E, A, R, ear. Next, say how many legs does a frog has? How? There are four legs. So the, the two in front, 
Okay, the two in front, we call them four leg. Again, the leg in front, we call them four leg. Let's spell the word four leg. F-O-R-E-L-E-G. Four leg. So that is in front. Okay, the leg in front of a front. How about the leg at the back? So we called it hind leg. So this one, the two leg, legs at the back. Okay, hind leg. H I N D L E G. Hind leg. <clears throat> Very good. Let's say it again one more time, students. The part of a frog, the parts of a frog. R I Nostril Mouth Ear Four leg and hind leg. Very good. Now let's try to answer the activity I prepared for you. Okay, let us label the parts of the, of the frog. Yes, you can see the red arrows is pointing the body parts of the frog. Let's start number one. So what is the arrow pointing? What body part is that? Is it A, I, B, nostril, C, hind leg, D, ear, E, Mouth or letter F, four leg. What is your answer, students? Letter B. So what is letter B? Nostril, are you sure? Okay, let's check if your answer is correct. Is it nostril? Very good. The answer in number one is nostril. How about number two? What is the arrow pointing? Letter A. So what is letter A? <clears throat> I. Are you sure? Okay, let's check your answer. Very good. Number two is I. How about number three? What is that? The arrow is pointing what body part of the frog? Hmm? Letter E. What is letter E? Mouse. Let's see if your answer is correct. Very good. The correct answer is letter E. Mouth. Now let's proceed to number four. Okay, what body part is that? What is your answer? Letter D. What is letter D? Word. <clears throat> Ear. Let's see if your answer is correct. Is it really ear? Very good, students. Good job. Now let's proceed to number five. What is that? What do we call the leg in front of the frog? Is it letter C or letter F? Letter F. What is letter F? Four leg. Let's see if your answer is correct. Four leg. Very good. The two leg in front of the frog is called four leg. Okay, and obviously, number six is hind leg. It's the leg of the frog at the back. Very good, students. Okay, one more time. Nostril. Eye. Mouth, ear, foreleg, and hind leg. Hind leg. So these are the parts of a bra. Very good, students. Okay, now it's time for you to do activity number two. Everybody, get your notebook and your pencil and your crayons. What you're going to do is draw and write the body parts of a frog. 
You understand, students? Okay, you may start doing it now. That's all for today, students. I hope you had fun and you enjoy our lesson for today. Teacher, I will see you again tomorrow. Don't forget to wear your mask when you go out and to wash your hands properly. Bye-bye.